Oh, the Pontefract Gold Cup Handicap is next then, and get yourself a drink while this one's on, because it's a long one. It's two more five furlongs, 0 to 100, and the top one is all or Sandman for Molly Etzer for Golden Birdie for David Robertson, Shut Master for Graham Clutterbuck, Obi-Wan has got the next two, Rocky Nanty and Dicios, and Rum C for Doug Warren is the bottom one, so just six then, and away they go, six of them over two miles and four furlongs. Cheers, everybody. You've got yourself a drink. We'll celebrate the end of the season. The end of SO6 all together. And Rum C is the leader. From Shutmaster in second. Golden Birdie is third. And All or Sandman and the Obi Wan pair at the back as we watch the synchronised dancing going on in the crowd. There's going to be a two or four furlong race, two or five furlong race, not really much going on. So they're practicing their synchronised clapping and waving. And they'll be on the next Spice Girls tour. You see them racing towards us. Rumsey is in the lead. There we go. One hand up and one hand down. Shake it all about. Now do nothing when the horses are going by and then start clapping again when they've gone. That makes a lot of sense. <laughs> Ron C is the leader from Shutmaster in second. Rockin' Anti is third, then all or Sandman, Golden Birdie, and finally Dicios, who is the back marker at this stage of the race. And they're into the final two fur two furlongs, two miles. So people probably go, I wish they were into the final two furlongs. Love them or loathe them, these long distance races, aren't they? Some of them are quite competitive, some of them are a little dull. Especially the really low grade ones. This one isn't a low grade one. It's got a, quite a small field sometimes. There's not many people can get in. But this week there's a lot of two mile races. There was a two mile three race yesterday. There was a, what was that today? I can't remember now. And what, the Melbourne Cup, of course, and then plenty of other long distance races. I don't know what's going on now. We seem to be walking on the water or something. But it's from C in the lead. Shot Master in second. And all Sandman, Rockin' Anti, Golden Birdie, and Dicios as we. Take a look at them from the blimp, as they like to say. And I wonder how far up we can go. Let's see what happens, how far, how far up we get. This is, I'm not doing this, by the way, I'm just commentating on it. I'm sure the race runner, whoever it is, was probably thinking that let's do something to make it interesting because the order doesn't change much in these flat long distance races. And a lot of the time, when there's only five or six in it, maybe that's as far up as we can get. We now come plummeting down to earth. Rum C is still the leader, as you can see. From Shotmaster Rocking Ante on the inside, Golden Birdie on the outside, and Dice lost the back market. Or oh, Sandman between them. And still Rum C in front. As they race down towards the final mile. In that mile point shortly, we get a little flash of the water again there. And Rum sees in the lead. A rocking anti now coming up on his outside, and rocking anti might have just poked his nose in front. Rocking anti from Rum, Rum C and Shut Master and Golden Birdie. All or Sandman and Dicios at the back. And it's an Obi Wan bookending race at the moment, then. With rocking anti the leader as we go back up in the air again. It's like somebody's putting the sandbags out of the balloon, and up we go, and then putting them back in again. Let in the hot area or however they did it. Oh, he go down. I'm not sure he'd go up. I think he sort of put a load of hot air into the balloon there or something, and you let it out to come back down again. Anyway, I'm going to go up in one of It doesn't really matter. We've got the back now. Rum C's been pulled up by the looks of things. So, Rum C is being pulled up. And he's out of the race. And Rocky Nanty is still the leader. That means that all five of these are going to get some last week of the season cash. And All or Sandman has suddenly made his break for the front to try and claim the biggest pot of the lot. And it's All or Sandman in the lead from Rocky Nanty second. Golden Birdie is third. Shutmaster is fourth. And Dicios is fifth. And to the final three furlongs now. And All or Sandman. All or Sandman is in the lead. And we've got Jockey Camp for some reason on a, on a horse that isn't there. So what's going on there oh, Sandman's in the lead got absolutely no idea <laughs> close to the up oh here we go it's all or Sandman in the lead then from Rocky Nancy in second then Golden Birdie and Dicey as they come down towards the final furlong then and 
Paulo Sandman is in the lead, and I think the star of the race was probably the race winner who was doing all sorts of weird and wonderful things. And up towards the line, Paulo Sandman takes it for Molly at Server. Obi Wan's going to be second, and third, Rocking Anti Dicey off then Golden Birdie. Then Shut Master and Run C was pulled up, so that's the Pontiff Rat and Gold Cup then. And it's gone to Molly at Surfer with All or Sandman, Rockin' Anti 2nd Obi-1, Dysios 3rd Obi-1, Golden Birdie 4th David Robertson and Shutmaster for Graham Clutterbuck was 5th.